New tonight, a new river neighborhood overrun by cows. This is what uh, people are dealing with up there right now. David Caltabiano shows us the concerns residents have about this herd. Well, these cows have been creating an utter problem in this neighborhood, trashing up properties. Residents also have concerns with how they look. Rancher Sean Brady expects animals in New River. We have coyotes, bobcats, and javelina run through here. But he never thought he'd wake up to this in his front yard. That, yeah, it's a very large animal taking up the whole window. This cow is a different story. The story with these cows can be seen in what used to be Sean's beautiful landscape. We've had really nice bushes. These are beautiful. And they just come through and destroy that. They've gone in there and just wasted that area. The New River resident, along with others, not only have concern with what the cattle eat and leave behind, they're also worried about how malnourished they look. Oh, it's so sad and we want to do something, but if you help them, they'll come and cause more damage to your property. So, but it, I mean, we have to drive by them and oh, it's just, it's so sad. Nobody knows who owns the cattle. People in the area told Arizona's family that they were told the cows were legally roaming and that they'd have to fence up their properties. Just to keep them back. So now, Sean's ranch looks like a fortress, complete with an electrical fence. But uh, yeah, it does give a little bit of a, a, a shock. Uh, nothing that would really hurt a person bad. It's not, see, that, that's nothing. But they'll feel it. And they have turned around, but they also come right through. Arizona's family reached out to the Department of Agriculture on this issue, but so far we have not heard back leaving Sean and the people who live in this area. Uh, it doesn't matter what you put up, they can run it over. To have some real beef with whoever owns this livestock. I, I think it's very uh, disrespectful and inconsiderate of the rancher. Until the cows come home, I'm David Coltbiano reporting for Arizona's family.